Welcome back, Cardboard Warriors. How's everybody out there doing today? I got a Wild Devel Drain Collector's Box. Another one. We're going to bust into it. I'm going to work my way through a whole case of these. So hopefully we get something good in here. Uh, tear it open and find out. I'm going to cut it. I'm going to cut it. All right. Too much sugar. Yeah. All right. Will we get any value is the question. Uh, it's a really good set. I think it's... Uh, Probably the best side of the year so far. Um, I like it. I think, it's, I think it's a lot of fun. I think the enchantment reprints are just stellar. The crazy thing is that there's no value in the rares at all. And that's going to cause a problem. <laughs> so, um, I just, you know, they just want to make the sets too big. There's no point in making the sets as big as they make them. There's too much bulk in, in this side of the set. But let's see what we get here. Got a food token right out of the gate. Oh, food and human. And we got a likeness looter. And fire emancipation. Important lock whale. Fill this crown of winter. The goose mother, we've been goosed already. Oh no, it's all over. We got goosed. And that's it. Uh, the big news is there's an uncommon worth more than any of the rares in this set. Uh, oh, I was hoping that was going to be right out of the gate. That would have been fun. Uh, the up to bean stock, the green uncommon, is actually like a two dollar card, and all the rares are under two bucks in this set. So that that's kind of a bummer, you know. I mean, there's no chance of getting anything good unless you hit a good mythic pull, and that's just few and far between with this big of a set. Food human, genius prodigy, leyline of anticipation. Now the rares and the enchantments are still a little bit worth something, but even the rare lands not worth anything. They're man lands, but they're only less than a buck. Rest of the Spire. Gorgeous artwork. I love that artwork. All right. Anyway. Farsight Ritual. And the Restless Bivouac. And still. Uh, Dragon Mantle. Nightly Valor. Forest. And no Beanstalk. So. We're two packs in. We got another. <laughs> we literally have like $2 worth of value <laughs> out of... Probably twenty dollars worth of packs. All right, food and rat token, Leyland of Sanctity, Karmic Justice. Oh, and that's the anime one. All right, don't forget we gotta look for the anime cards. Um, Gumdrop Poisoner, Timber Paladin, Genius Prodigy again. Isn't that like the third one we got already in this box? What's going on here? Stab Wound, Utopia Sprawl, great card. Island, and up the Beanstalk. There we go. We got one of the Beanstalks. We got the uncommon that's worth more than any of the rares. <laughs> There's that. I just make sure we didn't miss any uh, anime cards here. I forgot to look for the anime cards. Mm, oops. I think it's only on the enchantments. Uh, yep, nothing. Okay. Didn't think so. And, I mean, anime rares aren't worth anything because the rares aren't worth anything, really. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, I think there's a couple of the, the anime rares that are. Food and a rat token. Scalding Viper. Oppression. Virtue of Courage. Finally, our first mythic and our second mythic, Moonshaker Calvary. One of the top three uh, as far as value. Yenna. Spreading Seas. Dark Tulage. Swampy. And that's it. Okay. So, we got a Beanstalk and we got two mythics and one anime rare so far. Oh, give us something good. Oh, hey. Human and food token again. But we got a foil virtue of loyalty with the showcase border, which is nice for our third mythic. Rest in peace. Bramble familiar. And another mythic, commander mythic, the Bernard. And another mythic, <laughs> the Ariat. So, three mythics in that one pack. Tangible virtue, season of growth. Forest. And a tough cookie. This game is a tough cookie to crack. Let me tell you. All right, so just like that, we went like three packs with no mythics, and then all of a sudden now we got five mythics. Two packs later, it's goofy. Food elemental and oh, gorgeous defense of the heart in the anime foil. Look at that. That's a pretty card. All right, that's that's making up for it. Oh, and another defense of the heart right after. What is going on here? Now that's the kind of duplication you don't complain about right there. Uh, yeah, we're not going to complain about that. Twinning twins doing the twinning. Some twinning. 
Got a twin the twinning. The end. Garug's uprising, hatching plans, planes. I guess the pack thought I was going overboard as well. So it decided to put a stop to it. It's like, you're done. The end. Yeah. The fact that the end isn't a split second spell really kind of annoys me. <laughs> it's called the end. It should be a split second. Food and mouse. Goblin bombardment. Leilana Sanctity. Uh, ooh, Eshiok. And uh, another mythic there. With the extended art. Uh, not anime. Uh, Lich Knight's Conquest. And Rowan for another double mythic pack. Season of Growth. Stab Wound. Mountain. And no more being stars. Alright. Five packs left. Well, the double defense of the heart really picked the box up. It was looking a little scary before that. <laughs> Food treasure. Food fight. I gotta build that deck. Fraying Sanity. Cruel Sound of Age. Court of Garenbrig. And Heartflame Duelist. Gryphonary. Ground Seal. Island. And that's all she wrote. Four more packs. Damn, they get packs like that. It's just... They could do a little better track printing and make it to where there's not quite as many feel bads by people to have to buy one or two packs. Human food, elusive honor, a oh, rustic study with the anime. We're killing it on the enchantments. Uh, Moss with Dread Knight, Spellbook Vendor, Godric, and Dark Tutelage, Compulsion. And that's it. I tell you, if they didn't put the enchantment reprints in this set, then this set probably would not be very well loved right now. Because of the fact there's no value in the rares at all. Oh, man. And there's only a few mythics that are big chase cards. Food fairy. Rest of Spark. Gorgeous, gorgeous art. Too bad it's not worth nothing. It's so pretty. Hardened Scales. Hey, there we go. Another nice enchantment. Restless Vine Stalk. Gruff Triplets and Song of Totentons. And Vampire Great, Grux Uprising, Swampy. And that's all. Alright, two more packs. I think uh, the enchantments have really helped out. <laughs> that seems to be the case with all of these boxes that I open. If it wasn't for the enchantments, we'd be hurting. Food Fairy, Lord Skitter's Blessing. Mana Flare, nice. Uh, Heart Flame Duelist, Wrangle Sprank, and the Three Blind Mice. Tremors of Virtue, Planes, and that's it. Alright, last pack. Come on, give us something crazy right at the end here. The first few boxes I opened of these, I got crazy amount of confetti foils, but I haven't gotten any in this case yet, I don't think. Food, Treasure, or did I get one in the first box? I might have got one in the first box out of this case. Force Fruition, another Rhystic Study. What is going on here? Oh, and a Virtual Knowledge right behind it. Werefox Bodyguard, Restless Fortress, Curiosity, nice. Dragon Mantle, Mountain. Oh, I thought we were going to get another Beanstalk right at the end. All right, so we got one Beanstalk in the whole, whole video uh, of the valuable uncommons. Um, we went so many packs without any mythics at all, but then we did end up with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 mythics at the end of the box. So that average out to one a pack, but we'd go like three or four packs with none and then get three mythics in one box or one pack. So, Virtual Knowledge, good card. Rowan, Ashiok, uh, Irrigate, Bernard, Virtual Loyalty. And the Moonshaker Calvary and the Virtue of Courage. So we got three out of the five virtues and the Calvary. So not bad at all there. And then, of course, here's the big news. We double tapped two of the best cards you can get in the whole thing. Defense of the Heart, Anime Foil, and Regular. Rhystic Study, Anime, and Regular. So that is very weird. <laughs> uh... That just doesn't make sense to me, but I'm glad it happened because that actually paid for the box. So there we go. I'm pretty sure this box actually came out ahead. And then we got the other anime, Karmic Justice with a rare. Cool looking card, but not a lot of value there.
But anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Don't forget to check out the description below. There's a lot of good links down there. Save you good money, get your cash back on all your purchases. Help you kind of absorb some of the uh, some of the cost of this game. Let me tell you, if you're not uh, doing well financially, this probably isn't a good game for you to be getting into because it's kind of pricey these days. So and the prices keep going up. Good old greedy Hasbro there. All right, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.